The Russians have always maintained a penchant for a successful tank design ever since unveiling the war-winning T-34 tank during World War II. The T-72 Euro main battle tank proved no exception. It was developed as a cheaper, more reliable, however less capable alternative to the T-64. The T-72 had excellent speed for its class and an inherent reliability that's always required by the modern battlefield. Some interesting facts. Germans estimated that the Soviet T-72 could penetrate frontal armor of the early Leopard 2 tanks at a range of 1,500 meters and frontal armor of Leopard 1 tanks at more than 3,000 meters. When the Soviet T-72 tank would first be deployed, Richard Nixon was President of the United States. The F-4 Phantom was America's primary fighter and the world's steel beasts had yet to discover a nemesis called the wire-guided anti-tank missile. By Western standards, this tank had poor night vision capability, which was a serious drawback. When it comes to war, the T-72 was never used in the Afghanistan war. However, it was employed by the Russian army during fighting in the First and Second Chechnyan Wars and the Russo-Georgian War. The T-72 has been used in other wars like the Iran-Iraq War, the Lebanon War, Ethiopian-Somali Border War, the Georgian Civil War, and more. Of its design, the T-72 is protected by composite armor. At the time of its introduction, the T-72 could withstand any 105mm munitions at ranges greater than 500 meters. The front armor of the T-72 could not be penetrated by contemporary Dragon or tow anti-tank guided missiles, and side armor provides protection against IFV and helicopter cannons. Later production models would be fitted with side skirts. The T-72 has an NBC protection system. Its interior is lined with anti-radiation liner, which also acts as a spall liner. There's also an automatic fire extinguishing system, and the main battle tank was completed with a 125mm smooth bore gun. This gun fires rounds at much higher muzzle velocity than the Western 105mm rifled guns and is fitted with new carousel type autoloaders. If required, the gun can be loaded manually at a rate of 1 to 2 rounds per minute. A total of 39 rounds are carried for the main gun with an effective range of fire with APFSDS rounds about 2,000 to 3,000 meters and 850 and 13 meters during the nighttime. Armor penetration is around 590 to 630 millimeters of rolled homogeneous armor equivalent at 2,000 meters of range. The T-72 is also powered by a V46 diesel engine, which develops around 780 horsepower. The T-72 features a crew of three, a mass weight of 46,000 kilograms. It features one V84 or V12 air-cooled multi-diesel engine developing 840 horsepower with a maximum speed of 42 miles per hour and a maximum range of 483 kilometers. What do you think about this massive Russian beast? Let me know in the comments below, and while you're here, be sure to subscribe so that you can get more videos like this one in the future. Thanks for watching.